Hey folks, it's Jim uh, doing an update, further update on the GE Geo Spring. Sorry I didn't get it at the 30 day mark. That's what I was hoping to do. Uh, this is 42 days in um, and you can see we burned 36 kilowatts, which is about 857 watts per day, uh, right around there. And uh, you can see right now the heat pump is drawing 404.89 watts and it will get up to around 420, 430 and then it'll shut down. So you can pretty much time your heat pump cycle by the watt draw that it's at. It starts out in the 270 range, something like that, and then goes all the way up to 430 about there uh, through the heat pump cycle. And that's how I know when the heat pump's going to shut off. Uh, when it gets up to around 420, 430 watts of power. And I guess that's because it's a closed loop system. It develops the pressure. I think I've discussed that before. But I just wanted to do this update. Uh, 36 kilowatts over 42 days. That's it to make electric hot water. Absolutely amazing. I am definitely installing this um, in my camp. Uh, it's just too easy to power. Um, and a lot less headaches. Than a lot of other items so uh yeah without a doubt um and uh three four of my friends now are on these five actually i think now uh are have installed these everybody is absolutely happy uh so i can't say enough about them and just from my own test i don't see anybody else running a meter on theirs so that's why i'm doing this video series on the meter as i went through it uh so others could see it um, and you can get these meters online. They're not very expensive, but do not install them yourself if you're not an electrician or absolutely know what you're doing. Uh, unfortunately, people blow the coils up because they don't install them correctly. So I would hire somebody to install it. You know, they may charge you a house visit to install the meter. I don't know. Or have a friend who's an electrician install it. Um, but don't try and install this meter yourself. Um, you're messing with your panel. And if you get that coil installed wrong, uh, you're going to fry it. So, And it's dangerous to boot. Um, so I would recommend call somebody who is an electrician or um, just hire it out if you want to put a meter on yours. Uh, there are other ways to install meters. I just happen to like this because uh, the meter was such low cost, so it was the easiest way for me to do it. But uh, that's all I wanted to share. Uh, just another update on the GE Geospring uh, meter. And 36 kilowatts over 42 days. It's fantastic, folks. And um, for me, it is real. I've heard some people have had a little bit bad experience with these, but I have a feeling some of that has to do with the installation. I know that GE did put out uh, some compressors that weren't bad originally when they started putting these out. But from what I've heard lately, they are pretty much... Uh, operating fantastic so again i uh, just wanted to share that with this video uh, i'm having great luck with mine um absolutely enjoy it and i just wanted to pose this question imagine if everybody who is on electric hot water right now which is 30 percent of mo most people's electricity draw switched to a heat pump water heater how much money would that save how much energy would it save for uh, carbon usage in America. Just think about that. And that's one change we could all make to our homes to absolutely upgrade the efficiency of America. But you know, I do it for the economics of it personally, but I was just thinking about that. Um, lately we're getting so efficient with electricity, by the way, I don't know if you've been reading the articles, but the electric companies are actually scared. They have not, the power usage of today is the same as it was back in uh, the year 2000. So not only are we getting super efficient, it's actually going to start declining and the electric companies are actually getting extremely worried. There are articles out on it, read them, um, and it just shows how good we are getting as a people. We're getting pretty good folks. So, and this is just one major tool that we could all support and adopt that would absolutely just really take a huge bite of overall electricity co consumption in America. But anyway, I hope you're all doing well. Uh, this is just an update. 36 kilowatts over 42 days, and it runs two cycles a day on heat pump mode.
uh, uh, Jim out. Hope you enjoyed it.